Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Pokemon White. I would like to get our first real party member, but I think... I think we forgot how to play. Well, By I the way, what is our team? It's currently Oshawa and uh, Monkey. Oh yeah, Monkey. Monkey helped us beat the gym, so, you know. None of these are Pokemon we're keeping. No. We could have kept Oshawa. But I suppose what we'll do instead is we'll at we'll probably actually get to the point where we're playing Legends Arceus. And then I'll just pick Oshawa there. Could just play that next. And at this point, we'll get we gotta go through all the way up through not playing Sword and Shield and skipping it and playing Legends Arceus instead. But it's not a main game series. I mean, don't, I, I don't care. Game. Are we, are we, so we're going to skip Gen 8? No, we're going to play Arceus. Mm. I mean, unless you really want to play Sword or Shield. I, I guess I'm so not... So what you're saying is that... Like, and then just not Gen, Gen 9. Gen 9 doesn't exist. What's wrong with 9? Compared to 8. The graphics are worse. In some Which aspects, is amazing. in some aspects, but not all. Actually, texture work uh, on the Pokemon themselves improved greatly. Anyway, that's true. I, it's, yeah, it's a small pink orb. Oh, Found you, right. Mono. I was playing. I was playing a randomizer. Yeah. Yeah, it's, I haven't played it since. Also, I'm gonna getting just, that boomerang, but I'm gonna just turn your volume boomerang. down a little bit. There we go. All right. Oh, am I drink. allowed? No, uh, I fixed it. It's fine now. So yeah, you were playing a randomizer. Anyway, we're you interrupting know. Team Plasma, saying hi to this oh. mana. Um. Because they admit... yeah, and two's here. Hey, what? Hey, two. No, he's he's here. He exists. Are we streaming? Yes. Oh, in in the chat. Oh yeah, hello. Yeah, he's here. <laughs> That's this one that I never finished. It's Pokemon White. You've never finished Gen Five. So I've only... never played Gen Five, so I stopped at Gen Four. Yeah, so you're, you're, also, you're this similar. Is the generation with the the focus dash sturdy. That's all yes. I remember. It it did that. It also did hidden abilities. Anyway, we're gonna kick this mana until it emits Dream Mist. See, so, as I was saying, um, you played a randomizer. I played Two three randomizers. randomizers. And a your randomizer. <laughs> <laughs> I played I played a, quite a few randomizers recently. So what happened in the first one you were having issue with the second one you seem to have just finished easily oh yeah i, I breezed the through points. that one um it was much better the first two randomizers were um, ocarina of time and then i was like i played through two ocarina of times i don't want to do a third just right now also hang on team plasma music i don't think i know what's up I work tomorrow, so bye. Oh, okay. Bye, Tao. Bye. I don't think I've ever heard Team Plasma's song. It's really good. <laughs> if I low roll this, I'm dead. Yeah, I dig it. I dig the song. It's really good. Oh, we can have that discussion, I suppose. What's up? Favorite overall Pokemon soundtrack. Oh. See, I I don't know anything when it comes to Gen 5. And... You don't have to pick something you haven't played. This is your favorite. 
Gen 5 and 6, I haven't. Um, do remakes count as a new gen? Or, like, would so you consider, you, like... So, I, I would separate them out. But I said game, not gen. So... Game. Okay, well... Wait, no, I did say gen, didn't I? I meant game. Game. Mm. I kind of think, uh... Best overall. I kind of think sun and moon. Hey, guess what? Yeah. Ultra sun, ultra moon is my pick. What's the difference? the extra tracks like the rainbow rocket fights and stuff that you haven't seen sure um but it's but the like same it's, it's the same for the remix part. any song right nothing that i can remember but yep gen 7 i think is the the just sun moon ultra sun ultra moon best best soundtracks in pokemon so hey we agree yeah. second best it's just second best hmm because here, I don't have a clear, a clear answer. I'll give my answer after yours again. Anyway, Dream Mist happens, and then Geetza shows up. He just teleports in. He says, "Hey, like, goofing off." Well, Bonus Geetza. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know if I would say. Um, the BDSP has a good soundtrack. I don't know if I'd place it higher than uh, Oris, though. Mm. So that's that's interesting that you say that, because guess what? Oris? It's either Oris or, or, or Diamond Pearl BDSP. I, I haven't listened yeah. to BDSP and Diamond Pearl Platinum side by side uh, to really get a feel for the differences. But yep, it's it's either it's either the Hoenn games or the or the Sinnoh games for for second place for me, uh, for soundtrack. Um, that's kind of crazy that <laughs> that we're that we're in agreement there. I mean, they're just they're good. They're just good. They're just, just play them forever kind of soundtracks. Yeah. Yeah. But those are also like the, some of the newest entries. So like, well, but the soundtracks are generally the same in the remake. They might add some tracks. It's why I put, uh, it's why I have a hard time putting Oras over Diamond or of over Ruby Sapphire Emerald, because Emerald's got the Battle Frontier tracks, but Oras has Wally and Zinnia's themes, so it's hard. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Zinnia's theme and the uh, battle theme, just yeah. It's up there. Anyway, hey, Geats is uh is uh berating these guys now. They're... This is angry Geatsus. He ran away. Well Even just the soundtrack of Let's Go. Like uh, let's go is probably maybe. let's go the best version of the Kanto soundtrack. I just am not that big of a fan of the Kanto soundtrack. That's fair. Like it's got some good stuff in there. Just wait for a surfing theme. Let's go. Let's go. Badoof one. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, hey, look, a Musharna showed up to protect the, the the mana and made illusions or dreams that were just like hey make their boss show up that's cool oh and then they left you know they, they left they left an item in a pokeball yep turns dreams into reality that's a power. Don't worry about it. Oh, we found some dream mist. Wow. Okay. What? Well, um. Sadly, it's the game after this that introduced the Dex Nav. <laughs> or the Gen after this, I should say. Um. So. 
I don't think anything we want to catch is in here. But yeah, after 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 ORAS slash BDSP soundtracks, um, then I would probably put uh, Black 2, White 2. Which we'll get to. <laughs> and then Mystery Dungeon for the truck. Well, yeah, so Mystery Dungeon is in a league of its own. Uh, Explorers of Skies soundtrack is just that good. Uh, I wasn't counting side games, though, because you know what also would take high precedence? And it's a weird thing to say, but when you go listen back to the soundtrack, you'll be like, oh, yeah. Which Pokemon Quest. See, I should have known that one because, yeah, I was just listening to the Pokemon Quest soundtrack. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's insanely it has, just it goes has, hard. It has no reason to go that hard. And yet here we are. Like every song in that entire man, it's just, it sucks that that game doesn't get any updates. <laughs> right. Imagine if that got more Pokemon than just the first just Kanto added to it. I'd still be playing it, probably. But no, I gave up probably. on it, you know, less than a year in just because I was like, oh, it's never getting updated, is it? No, it apparently did get updates, but only in the mobile version in China. Yep, because which is as good as it not happening. Yep. Anyway, we got to go talk to Fennel again. I think I'm going to save just in case weird stuff happens. All right. Dream Mist. Save files of various trainers. C gear. OK, here's where we get the C gear. Yeah, we had to do this. It was required. So that's fine. So this is the um, this is black and white's version of the communication features. Uh, okay. I we're not going to turn them on because 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 this is DS. Yeah. Uh, anyway. So definitely a DS. There was there was stuff in here. You, you can you can like enter local like. Um, oh, all over the world. Never mind. You collect you connected to the to the Nintendo online service, uh, the old one, um, and you just grabbed random trainer data. And then, yeah, you go to this entry link place and you just did stuff around there. And that's how you got. And then it, it also uh, interacted with the there was a website for the game, like where you would like do mini games and stuff. And then it interacted with your save file because, you know, network functionality. And that's where you used to get Pokemon with hidden abilities. Uh, the, the dream world. The dream world. And you, that used to be where you got. Um, yeah, used to be where you got the uh, hidden abilities initially. Hmm. And then, yeah, you could actually you could actually run around and see, this was the first game where you could run around and see other players. I wait, no, sorry, outside of the underground and Diamond Pro Platinum, um, where you could actually like do like stuff. in li in real time. Or yeah, in real time. Yeah, and it was it's um. Let's see if I can pull up the map here because it's. Because, like, I love me some Gen 7, but the fact that it didn't have yeah, this anything. Area. <laughs> yeah, Gen 7 was... Yeah, didn't have it. Um, I mean, Gen 6 didn't have it either, right? I mean, Gen 6 had the PSS, which is still... Why didn't they keep it? It's still the greatest thing about Gen 6 entirely. But like, yeah, you'd physically go to this area when you were doing multiplayer stuff and there was stuff there. I never I didn't know anybody else who had Gen 5 games, uh, so I never got to experience it. And it's uh, it probably still works locally, but I will i don't I still don't know what's over. What's 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 about it? Yeah, because Gen 5 is that generation that no one played unless you're really hardcore. Hello, it's me, the person who played Gen 5. Excuse me, Lloyd. Lord Jabu Jabu leads to 
Phantom Ganon. Neat. Can I Phantom Ganon as a kid? No. Well, you might be able to if you have entrance rando. Yeah, but like my bosses not. are. But bosses probably. Are, uh, mm, gotta try it. I mean, yeah, nothing, nothing, nothing stopping you from trying. Am I still in town? Where am I right now? Oh, that's not grass. So yes, I am still in town. Okay. So I go up. Here we go. Route three. Okay. Um. Here's the daycare, I think. Yep. So you get the daycare pretty <laughs> early on. Slingshot works. Okay, I could do this. A <laughs> phantom cannon with the slingshot? Yes. All right. Oh. Double per line. Not assist into growl, which does literally nothing against two special attackers. Excellent. These were the first games that introduced the dynamic experience system. What's that? So, uh, this is uh, it's the system where you if you are over leveled, you get less experience from a Pokemon. And if you're under leveled, you get more experience from a Pokemon. Oh, OK. That started in these games. I seem to remember another game did that that we played and we hated it. Oh, I forgot about the rival fight. Mm. I'll be fine, though. I have a level 15. I think I can probably solo the whole thing. I hope so, because I did not save. Opening with Snivy. Snivy is level 14. OK, I'm going to swap. <laughs> HP. Now we're fine. Although it is faster than me, which is a bit of an issue. Oh, no. Uh, okay. Um. Thank God for Deco Sticks. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm. And, I, and I'm remembering right now how, just how slow our Oshawott is. So if Pantsier goes down, this could this could go bad. It's going to take two more, two more incinerates to actually kill, which <gasps> is ridiculous. That makes sense. Okay. I finished all the dungeons and I just got sing a song of time at the end. So like, thanks game <laughs> yeah there you go oh we speed tie oh everything's fine uh this is going bad no it's fine oh oh i thought that was our like oh because our low hp yeah 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 we're we're, we're fine we're fine <laughs> Every, everything's fine back to the sharon bianca battle wait it just really what, what? When one Pokemon has, I thought it was like, like last Pokemon low HP would 
Oh, Change those are two different. Those are two different things. When the gym leaders are on their last Pokemon, then the then the theme changes, and then that was the low HP theme. <laughs> oh, okay. Those are two different things. Assist isn't. You don't have any other Pokemon. But you still get to use their moves. Everything's fine. This probably doesn't do any damage. With your knowledge, you sure can do something, probably. I've seen what five Fury Swipe hits can do, and it's not a lot. Although I am annoyed that you hit Fury Swipes five times twice. Such a good move. Mm, yeah. Definitely not just a waste of time. Definitely not. Yeah, so how'd that Wind Waker go? It was... It was bad. Did you um, finish? Oh, yeah, I finished it, but it was bad. Anyway. Team Plasma. Team Plasma. Stole some Pokemon. All right. We're going. That's just unacceptable. But am I not... Yeah, I'm still injured. Uh, can I just? Yeah, I, okay, they're gonna let me go. <laughs> I need to go back and heal. Um, but yeah, it was bad because um, like I started the game out and like immediately got like seven Triforce shards, and like the bow and a bunch of stuff, and it was great. And then I did all of, like all of the checks available, and I didn't go anywhere. <laughs> like, yeah, like, like, literally two of the three, two of the three first items I got were the bow and the uh, grappling hook. I got those immediately, and it was like, oh, cool. Neat. Um, and then nothing for hours. Well, it wasn't nothing for hours, but it was like drip feed um like i'd find I, I i found like two tingle statues a bunch of triforce shards i was up to seven pretty early before i entering a dungeon and then it was just like a bunch of treasure shards go ahead and do those get basically nothing and then i'd find like one item right and I'd be like, OK, well, that lets me do these checks and I do all of those checks. And then on the last one, it'll be like, all right. Here's like some more treasure charts and like. At the end of that, it'll be like, oh, I got one item. And it'll no. be like the iron boots and it's like, oh, cool, I need those later. But literally the iron boots by themselves do nothing. Whoops. Oh. Um. And it's just like. It, th there wasn't any moment where I was like, oh, I can finally beat the seed. <laughs> it's like I, I dip into Dragon Roost, get nothing. Go over to Windfall, get nothing. And then like, it, it's all, it's all basically the entire time. It was the checks I was putting off because I didn't want to dip into like, basically I, I found a, I don't remember what, but I found a really important item at paw print because I had the hook shot or not the hook shot, uh, the grappling hook. I could go into paw print and get that, you know, the chest that's up on the, the grappling hook posts yeah. in, in paw print. Yeah. That, that that had like my fire and ice arrows or something like that, right? It was like, but I didn't want to go in there. Oh, did I accidentally hit tackle? Oh, we're fine. Never mind. Oh, I hit tackle again. Controller. I pushed down on the D-pad. You're doing it. Yeah, I mean, I am doing it. It's fine. Uh, but it was like I I I was putting that off because there's you know, other chests in there. 
that I would see. that I want, uh, you know, like I wanted to come get them all at once. Yeah, get them. all. But <laughs> um, okay, it's fine. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I want I wanted to get them all at once, so I needed the you know power bracelets or bombs. But it was like, nope, you have but to dip in there. Uh, don't you just hate that? Get that one item. And it's like, oh, now you can do other things. But it wasn't the power bracelets or bombs. So I had to come back later. And um, bombs were one of the last items I found. Oh, good. Yeah, you know, like one of the most important items in, in like most Zelda games because of how many checks they lock. So I spend the entire scene getting drip fed a couple items at a time, like a, a couple checks at a time and each time getting like one item. And then right when I've basically exhausted. Here, I. Well, I'll send you a screenshot of what my my tracker. I should still have the tracker uh, state. <laughs> oh, no. Before I just. Uh... Yeah. And then what? Yeah. So print screen this, send it to Toxin. Like, look at this. Look at this. Look at this suffering. Look at this suffering. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even a joke. Look at this suffering. Um, you you want to know where that last Triforce shard was? The worst. Where? Uh, so do you, do you see how um what what are my pinned checks? Pinned? How do you know which one's pinned? I don't. I don't. I don't actually use a tracker. Oh, it's so. under. It's under. It's on the. It's 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 all the it's under pinned locations. Oh wait, it's not showing up on this on this screenshot. Okay, it yeah. doesn't show up on the screenshot because I I didn't full screen it. But basically, a uh, masked beetle shop. Um. For um. I needed both the five hundred and nine hundred rupee items from beetle shop. Oh, that's good. Yeah, great. One of them was I forget, but it was like a key to a to a dungeon, and the other one was a treasure chart. No, sorry, they were both treasure charts. But one of them had a key to a dungeon, and the other one was a um the a Triforce chart. So on top of paying five hundred rupees to get the Triforce chart. I needed to then go get it deciphered. So it was actually 900 rupees. <laughs> uh, and then that gave me the last Triforce shard. Um, and then I got to go to Hyrule finally. And then in Hyrule, what did I find in the Master Sword pedestal? Dragon Roost Cavern boss key. Oh, great. So that I had to go back to Dragon Roost. Back to, welcome back to Fire Temple. Welcome back to Fire Temple. And, um... Um... What was that? Oh, yeah. Dragon... Okay, so... So, but the other thing that I'm not telling you is when I, when I beat Dragon Roost, guess what I got? I'm gonna assume not your power boost. No, look at the look at the what am I what what am, very important thing am I missing on that tracker? Oh, um, the song. Yeah, and... guess what song that is. Uh, 
that the Song of Winds? No, no. it's not the Song of Winds. No, you start, with, yeah. you, start with, you start with the Song of Winds and the Song of Passing and the Warp Song. The Song of uh, G- Ballad of Gales or something like that. I don't remember. Which but, um, one is that? I forget the... So it's it's the order that you learn them. With the Warp yes. Song being at the last one because it's optional. 